Welcome to our tech tutorial. Today, we're tackling a question that many developers encounter when working with AWS S3. Our viewer is using Express and Malter S3 to upload files, but they want to know how to specify an upload directory within their S3 bucket. Let's dive into the details and find out how to organize those files effectively. Welcome back guys to another technical help question. I'll be going through the question, the answers, and hoping to help find that answer. Guys, I hope you stay crazy just a little bit like me and get through and work to the solution. Now let's get started. To specify an upload directory in Malter S3 for your AWS S3 bucket, we need to modify the key function in your Malter S3 configuration. In the key function, you can concatenate the folder name with the file name. For example, if you want to upload files to a folder named Uploads, you can do it like this. Now let's see the complete updated Malter S3 configuration with the folder path included. Finally, with this configuration, any file uploaded will now be stored in the Uploads folder within your specified S3 bucket. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To specify an upload directory in Malter S3 for your AWS S3 bucket, simply add the folder name right after your bucket name, making sure to include a slash in front. In the Malter S3 configuration, you can also define metadata and the key for the uploaded file. Use the current timestamp combined with the original file name for unique keys. And that's it. I hope this video has helped you get through to that resolution that you're looking for. If it did, please hit subscribe. And until next time you need technical help, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.